In this example, I need to find the domain and range of the quadratic function that has a minimum value of negative 5 when x equals 7. Well, what does the graph of a quadratic function look like? It's either going to be a parabola that opens up or a parabola that opens down. When the parabola opens up, the y value of the vertex is the minimum value of the function, and this function does not have a maximum value as the function keeps going up forever. When the parabola opens down, the y value of the vertex is the maximum value of the function, and this function does not have a minimum value as it keeps going down forever. So our quadratic function, we were told, has a minimum value of negative 5. So it cannot be a parabola that opens down. So I know my graph is going to look like this. And now, what is the domain of this function? This is very easy because the domain of every single quadratic function is all real numbers otherwise known in interval notation as negative infinity to positive infinity. Now the range is not all real numbers. It depends on whether the parabola opens up or down, and I need the coordinates of the vertex. So this vertex occurs when x equals 7, the x value is 7, and the minimum value of the function negative 5 is the y value of the vertex. So what is the range? Are there any y values below the vertex? No. If I come up from negative infinity in the y direction, the first y value I'm going to hit is negative 5. There is a point where y equals negative 5, so I use a square bracket on the negative 5. And where does this y value keep going to? All the way to infinity. So the range is square brackets negative 5 comma to positive infinity with a parenthesis on it.